with the growth that was happening in our market, we had to get more efficient. That's ultimately why we chose Fortman. Beforehand, we would maybe be processing two to three loads up front at a time and stay ahead of the fitters and welders. Now we're, we're up into 12 to 15 loads ahead of our fitters and welders and processing. My name is Matt Bennett, president of Bennett Steel. Been involved with the business since I can remember. Bennett Steel's main core businesses were a structural steel fabricator, miscellaneous steel fabricator, stairs, handrails. Um, we erect our own steel. Currently we have um, 65,000 square feet under roof between two facilities. Various types of projects fit our niche is, I mean, anywhere from small 10 ton fabrication, erection jobs, all the way up to multi-thousand ton fabrication and erection jobs. With the growth that was happening in our market, we had to get more efficient. And we had to invest in equipment that was gonna be dependable for the next 15 to hopefully 20 years. That's ultimately why we chose Wortman. Well, the system we chose with is a MSI system of a 631 drill line, splits and goes to two saws and goes into the 807. The drill line, the 631, is a great machine. I mean, the speed it drills holes, um, the layout, the etching, the precision of it, the measuring system is amazing on it. Even the user friendliness of the software, the VACAM, is the system runs, runs great. The less you have to do at the machine, the better. We usually spend anywhere between three to, three to four days to get programming done. Now programming's done in about an hour. After it leaves the drill, it splits off into two saws where the saw system itself, we did a time study on our old saw compared to this saw. Our old saw, it took almost an hour to make that cut. The two 1050s that we bought cut that same beam in five minutes. Just the speed, the precision. Well, and after everything's turned on and the commissioning team, they, they basically stay with you until as long as you need them to for the training. Um, I think it took our guys roughly three, three weeks to really get comfortable with it. And during the time it's, it's running and commissioning and training, you're, you're actually able to run your own production. The labor that's not involved with removing your drops, removing your scrap, it's, it's a time saver and ultimately a body saver on these guys that operate the machines. If, as long as everything's done in VACAM correctly, you really just push a button and push start. And they'll pick it up when it's done at the end. By having this MSI system, it produces and processes steel faster than I've seen any other machine do. You hit go at the beginning, it pushes you get all the way through all four machines. Every one of them talk to each other. There's no second guessing that piece is done or not. The machine knows whether it dug it out the drill or the 807, what to do. Cleanliness and the precision of the cuts on the 807 is by far the fastest, the cleanest. Before we had the 807, we had another robotic arm coper that would only cut three sides, so we couldn't cut the slots or the notches and tubes. So those all had to be hand laid out, cut with the torch, cleaned. That's one of the biggest efficiencies we've seen with this machine. There was a time we had to have approximately five to six trained operators on them. Now we have a line taking our operators down to possibly just two or three. I don't think I can get them to go back to two thin on the field. Yeah, we're excited to see what, what the future holds for us here. Um, we'll see. Maybe the, we'll probably have to coming out something new and shiny. We'll have to go buy it too.